but very tender. It was garlic that made him strong. Where does the spinach part belong? A live-action movie based on the iconic character Popeye the Sailor Man is currently the works. Popeye originally appeared in a comic strip in 1929 and has since become a beloved figure in comic strips and animated shows. The last major adaptation of Popeye was the 1980 film starring Robin Williams. According to Variety, a new Popeye movie is being developed as a big-budget feature. The screenplay for the movie is being written by Michael Caleo. As of now, there is no main cast announced for the project, but its development has been confirmed. This means that fans can look forward to a modern retelling of Popeye's adventures on the big screen. The upcoming Michael Caleo written Popeye movie will mark the first live-action adaptation of the character in 44 years, following the 1980 Robin Williams-led film. The Williams version, made with a $20 million budget, was a commercial success, grossing $60 million and earning cult classic status, especially among fans of Robin Williams. Given the success and legacy of the Williams Popeye movie, the new adaptation has high expectations to meet. Popeye has a rich history beyond the 1980 film, including a short-form animation series titled Popeye the Sailor that aired from 1960 to 1962. These animated shorts, each about six minutes long, are an integral part of Popeye's cultural legacy and contribute to the character's enduring popularity. However, these previous iterations also provide a wealth of material and beloved segments that the new movie can draw upon. The new Popeye movie may choose to incorporate some of the most cherished elements from the original cartoons, adding to its appeal and nostalgia for fans. As the development of the live-action Popeye film continues, more details about the cast and creative direction are expected to be revealed in the coming months. Fans can anticipate updates and announcements that will shed light on how the filmmakers plan to approach and honor the legacy of Popeye the Sailor Man in this new adaptation. On the other hand, Steamboat Willie is now public domain, and Popeye artist Randy Milholland has created the perfect tribute to Mickey Mouse. Randy Milholland, a Popeye artist, has revealed plans for a new comic based on Steamboat Willie, a Mickey Mouse short. This announcement coincides with Steamboat Willie entering the public domain, marking a significant event in the entertainment industry in 2024. Many creators have announced projects based on the cartoon, with most focusing on horror themes as quick money-making schemes. However, Milholland's comic stands out as it goes beyond mere parody and offers a unique take on the Steamboat Willie story, promising a fresh perspective on the classic cartoon. Randy Milholland, known for his work on the Sunday Popeye feature and the webcomic Something Positive, has introduced a new comic titled Mouse Trapped. This comic series revolves around Mickey Mouse, specifically portraying him as he appeared in the Steamboat Willie cartoon. Milholland's goal with this comic is to explore what transpired for Mickey Mouse after the events depicted in the Steamboat Willie short film, offering a unique continuation of the classic character story. In a post on X, Milholland mused that he was perhaps the only creator doing a Steamboat Willie riff that was not out to twist or mock the character. Steamboat Willie, released in 1928, played a pivotal role in launching the Disney media empire by introducing iconic characters like Mickey and Minnie Mouse. This short film set the foundation for Mickey Mouse's adventures and became a landmark in American animation. After 96 years since its release, Steamboat Willie's copyright expired on January 1, 2024, placing it in the public domain. This means that while later versions of Mickey Mouse are still protected by copyright, Steamboat Willie itself is now open for anyone to create new works based on its content without legal restrictions. Following Steamboat Willie's entry into the public domain, several derivative works inspired by the cartoon have been announced or created. For instance, a slasher film titled Mickey's Mousetrap, based on Steamboat Willie, was announced just a day after the cartoon became public domain. Additionally, numerous memes featuring the Steamboat Willie version of Mickey Mouse have circulated widely on the internet, and comedian John Oliver pledged to use the character as a mascot for his show last week tonight. However, despite the excitement surrounding these new works, the legal implications of Mickey Mouse's public domain status are complex. While Steamboat Willie itself is now free to use, Disney's trademark and copyright protection for later iterations of Mickey Mouse are still in place. When it comes to power-ups, few are more iconic than Popeye's spinach-infused superpower boosters and Goku's Dragon Ball transformation. These power-ups help the heroes overcome formidable challenges that would have otherwise ended their journeys prematurely. 
despite the significant differences between the two franchises, their shared theme of powerful enhancements led to an official collaboration between them. Both Popeye and Goku have developed ways to protect themselves from common threats due to their experiences and training. Popeye, through his work as a sailor on rough seas, has a general means of defense. However, when facing formidable foes like Bluto Brutus, he relies on eating spinach, which gives him super strength and energy to overcome the danger. Although there have been horror reimaginings of Popeye, the character has generally been inactive. Similarly, Goku's lifelong martial arts training equips him with substantial abilities to handle most challenges. Yet, when faced with overwhelming threats, Goku transforms into a more powerful version of himself using the energy and skills gained from Dragon Balls, enabling him to defeat powerful enemies. In a post on June 3, 2022, Popeye's official Twitter account shared fan art by artist Marcus Williams, featuring Popeye and Goku from Dragon Ball. The artwork depicts the two characters sharing a laugh after what appears to be a workout session. The illustration reflects their happy-go-lucky personalities and suggests that they enjoy each other's company. Popeye's Twitter post expressed gratitude for the ongoing love and attention from fans over the years. The post subtly hints at the idea of a potential team-up between Popeye and Goku, considering that Dragon Ball had previously crossed over with One Piece. While it might not be the most obvious collaboration, the fan art and the official acknowledgement from Popeye's account indicate that such a crossover could be possible if the creators decide to explore it. On May 22, 2020, artist Marcus Williams shared the image of Popeye and Goku on his personal Twitter account. The caption mentioned that he came up with the idea while watching Dragon Dragon Ball videos for nostalgic reasons, naming his concept Dragon Ball plus Popeye World Breakers. Along with the Popeye and Goku artwork, Williams also posted several other images featuring characters from both series, expanding on his vision of a collaboration between Popeye and Dragon Ball. These additional images showcase Williams' interpretation of what a crossover between the two franchises would entail, creating a blend of comic and manga styles that fans appreciate as a creative and exciting concept. While there's no confirmation of an official Popeye-Dragon Ball collaboration featuring Popeye, Goku, and their respective crews, there seems to be interest in the concept from Popeye Official. The return of Popeye through Gendy Tartakovsky's upcoming movie indicates that the iconic sailor could soon become more relevant than ever. The fan art examples, such as those by Marcus Williams, suggest that a team-up between Goku from Dragon Ball and Popeye the Sailor could lead to plenty of fun and exciting stories. While it would be an unlikely pairing in comic history, the imaginative possibilities showcased in these artworks hint at the potential for entertaining adventures if such a collaboration were to happen in the future. And there you have it. As we dive into the exciting world of Popeye, Mickey Mouse, Goku, and beyond, it's clear that the realms of animation and comics continue to captivate audiences across generations. Are you excited about the upcoming Popeye movie or intrigued about the possibilities of a Popeye-Goku crossover? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more fascinating updates on your favorite characters and franchises.